art. And then pandas. And then the flash. And is that Latino Heat and Guerrero? And the man Becky Lynch. And I had to ask this man, sir, who are you? I. I you ask. Yes, I you. Artist AJ Moore. Well, hello, Mr. AJ. Can you uh, tell me what was your inspiration in getting all of this? Inspiration? Well, my inspiration comes from a lot of different things. First, let me tell you. Wrestling. I've been a wrestling fan all my life since I was a little kid. So, it just kind of goes without saying. I'm mean, it's all wrestling stuff. Pandas? I just love pandas. I just love pandas. Pandas are cute, cuddly, and I can dress them up as other things. So, that's how I have some fun. All the other stuff, I was always a comic book fan, love cartoons, Tom and Jerry, you know what I'm saying, you know, a little bit of uh, Ninja Turtles, and, you know, He-Man, all, all that kind of stuff, Thundercats, and it led me to all doing all this. That is awesome. Let's, to the wrestling one, like, yeah, let's talk wrestling. you, you, I see you got The Fiend, who's just coming onto the scene, the current WWE Universal Champions. Yes, yes. We got the man, Becky Lynch. I see Charlotte, I see you, Charlotte. But then we got the OG Bullet Club with the Prince David. Yes. Tama Tonga, Bad Luck Fale, Carl Anderson, and Luke Gallows, who are criminally underrated, underused right now. And of course, one of the greatest tag teams on the planet, the Young Bucks. And I'm just looking at the detail. You got your boys like nine pack. I don't even understand how you that swole. You got Bad Luck Fale's constant just boss face. What I'm loving personally though is Tamatanga's um, face paint into the beard. Because I don't understand how the hell he gets it so good every time. Yeah. How long did that take? That one, something like that, generally takes like 25, 30 hours or so. But I try to get under 20. But there's a whole lot of faces in there. So you know you got to put a lot of time into it. So. I mean, that's, that's pretty much the down because it's all done in marker. It starts off with pencil, and I go in with the marker, and I'm always listening to some of, you know, or watching wrestling as it's going on. And, yeah, about 25-ish hours or so. Okay. So, yeah. All right, and then we go over here to something I never thought I would see at Wizard World, Blank Man. And for those of you who don't know, to black nerds like me, this was the ish back in the day. Can you can you explain Blank, Blank Man to the people? Blank Man. Okay. For those who don't know, first of all, y'all need to go do some homework. This is uh, David Allen Greer and uh, Damon Wayans. These were black superheroes back in the day. Now, these were uh, comedy. This is all comedy. So, it's really, really funny. Blank Man is a, you know, Blank Man is a nerd. You know, he's trying to find himself. But he loves, you know, comic books and stuff. You know, just like we do. So, Blank Man discovers how to become a superhero and you know he goes to I, I don't want to spoil it all but him and this is other guy because <laughs> brother didn't even get a name but they just called him other guy because Link Man was really about you know trying to trying to develop his, himself but he needed a sidekick too but the sidekick didn't get a name so he just called him other guy so they go on adventures and stuff like that but y'all just really got to check it out Blank Man I mean, there was all the blank suits that they're wearing, you know, and those 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 nunchucks in his hand, those were, those were the noon chucks. Uh, you turn them on, and they would spin. Uh, yeah, it was great. Blank man, blank man. It was Damon so Wayne. cool. Now, y'all know I love pandas, and I'm most likely buying one of these prints today. But I gotta ask, what made you <laughs> combine both pandas and just? Geekness together in such a beautiful, beautiful, adorable way. First off, thank you for that compliment. Uh, the pandas, I just love pandas, like I was saying earlier. Pandas are cool, pandas are cute, and I love all, a lot of these different characters Marvel, DC, stuff like that. So I took the panda and I just dressed him up uh, as cosplay since I can't never cosplay myself because I'm always working at these shows. But there's such wonderful cosplay here. So I took the panda and just kind of put him in different cosplay. It's all the same panda. The panda's name is Chi Chi. Chi Chi the cosplaying panda. And Chi Chi just loves different types of fandoms. So Chi Chi dresses up as those things and just cosplays. So we got Chi Chi as the Black Panther, uh, Killmonger. But there's always, there's always a catch. There's always... It's 3 for 20, just in case you're wondering. 
See the ice cream there? I see it. The panda loves ice cream. This Chi Chi loves ice cream. Love popsicle. There's always a popsicle or something cold. Some kind of cold stuff in most of them. One of my favorites is the BB-8 one. But uh, yeah, this is it. There we go. Yeah, that's a good shot there. Got Palpatine, got Darth Vader. So yeah, that's Chi Chi the Cosplaying Panda. So y'all should check it out. Uh, just if you look on Instagram under the hashtag Chi Chi Cosplay Panda, you'll find it. And if you want to find anything else uh, that I've drawn or created, uh, look under Artist AJ Moore. Artist AJ Moore, all one word. If you're hashtagging it, and yeah, you can find me on Facebook, Instagram, uh, let's see, Pinterest, and Twitter as well. Well, thank you, Mr. AJ. I appreciate your time and all of your effort and art. I hope you had a great weekend, sir. Yeah. Oh, I have a great weekend. Man. Thank All you so time. much, sir. Thank you. Yeah.